In recent days, we've had a broader conversation about the tone and civility of our national dialogue. Everyone will benefit if we can end the politics of personal destruction. Amen. We must unify as a nation in peace, love, and in harmony. The media has a major role to play, whether they want to or not. And they do indeed. They have a major role to play as far as tone and as far as everything. <laughs> and we all say this in all sincerity, but the media's constant unfair coverage, deep hostility, and negative attacks, you know that, only serve to drive people apart and to undermine healthy debate. For example, we have seen an effort by the media in recent hours to use the sinister actions of one individual to score political points against me and the Republican Party. Yet when a Bernie Sanders supporter tried to murder congressional Republicans and severely wounded a great man named Steve Scalise and others. We did not use that heinous attempt at mass murder for political gain because that would have been wrong. It would have been the wrong thing to do. Many other examples could be brought up. Nor do we blame the Democrat Party every time radical leftists seize and destroy public property and unleash violence and mayhem. Yet the media has tried to attack the incredible Americans who support our movement to give power back to the people. That's what our movement is.